2003, a pizza delivery man with a collar bomb around his neck robbed a PNC bank. When cops caught him, he said he was forced to do it. Shortly thereafter, the bomb exploded, killing the delivery guy. Later, the police found out that he was just a victim and was being held as a bomb hostage. August 28, 2003 was just an ordinary day for middle-aged pizza delivery man Brian Wells. His first delivery of the day was outside of Erie, Pennsylvania. It's still unclear exactly what happened, but he stepped into a small building and later became a bomb hostage. A metal collar was placed around his neck that featured four keyed locks and two pipe bombs in it. He was handed a shotgun and gave nine pages of instructions on how to complete several tasks to get the keys and make his way out of the collar bomb. His first task was to rob a branch of the PNC bank. He escaped with $8,700 in cash, but it was immediately found by the cops. He said he was forced to do it and told them about the bomb. The cops immediately called the bomb squad, but before they could arrive, the bomb exploded, killing Wells. 